Hey everyone, Mars J Gate here. I'm back from my vacation. Just got back yesterday. And of course, the first day back on schedule and Warp Tour 2016 decides to announce the bombshell. Their ban list. <sighs> I've been pretty busy today, so I didn't really get a chance to record any new footage. Uh, I apologize for that, but please bear with me. This year's Warp Tour has introduced the new Monster Party Zone. Which basically includes the new Monster North and South stages. Here are the list of bands. Atreyu, Bullet for My Valentine, Crown the Empire, Every Time I Die, Ice Nine Kills, Motionless in White, The Color Moral, The Word Alive, Volumes, White Chapel, Chelsea Grin, Cold Rain, Cruel Hands, From Ashes to New, Gideon, In Heart's Wake, Ocean 8 Alaska, Vanna, Vale of Maya, uh, for the new Journey's Right Foot stage, we have 303, Issues, Mayday Parade, Pepper, Real Friends, Sleeping with Sirens, State Champs, The Main, The Story So Far, and Tonight Alive. Journey Left Foot stage, we have Falling in Reverse, Four Years Strong, Good Charlotte, Less Than Jake, New Found Glory, Real Big Fish, Set It Off, Sum 41, The Summer Set, We the Kings, and Yellow Card. For the Full Sail University stage, we have Avion Row, Bad Seed Rising, Broadside, Cane Hill, Capsize, Dash 10, First to Eleven, Hail the Sun, Lake Pacific, Morton Monroe, Mother Feather, Old Wounds, Palais Royal, Reckless Serenade, Safe to Say, Say We Can Fly, Silent Planet, The New Low, Wage War, and With Confidence. For the Poseidon stage, we have Amorosa, Icy Stars, Knuckle Puck, Mast Intruder, Prof, Rome, Secrets, The Hares, The Interrupters, and Young Guns. For the Cyclops stage, we have Against the Currents, Assuming We Survive, Ballyhoo, Chunk, No Captain Chunk, Ghost Town, Sykes, Teenage Bottle Rocket, Too Close to Touch, and Water Parks. Waka Fa Flocka Flames has also been announced, though I don't really know what stage he's going to be playing on. And Kevin Lyman has announced that the Ghost Inside will be playing on Warp Tour 2017. He has guaranteed them a spot. This is the first time that he has ever confirmed a band for next year's Warp Tour, so that's very interesting. And I truly hope that the Ghost Inside is able to make it. I hope. If they can't, though, I fully understand it. Um, you know, this is a long road for to recovery for them. So, yeah. Normally, Warp Tour will add in new bands as the summer draws closer. So, this list may not be entirely complete just yet. I will be including all the bands that haven't announced so far in the description along with the dates they'll be playing through. So, what do you guys think of this warp, year's Warp Tour? Are you excited? Disappointed? Upset? Let me know in the comments below. I hope you guys enjoyed. Marsh J. Gate, we'll see you all later.